nifty9.com so in today's video i will be talking about the nest terminal and i will be telling you how i was able to save 75000 by using some of the features of nest terminal so do watch this video till the end so that you will know the benefits of using the nest terminal okay before i tell you the features of nest terminal let me tell you why do we actually need a good terminal see when you open an account with any broker it can be zerodha angel motilal kotak sher khan they give you their own proprietary terminal okay which is good enough you can place and do most of the things what we do in nest terminal but why do we actually need a good terminal the reason is these proprietary terminals are not very reliable so i have used a lot of terminals in the past and the problem is they sometimes hang and they sometimes don't update and especially if it is a browser driven terminal then it uh, it is very difficult to do a lot of things they will not have a lot of features so it is better if you are handling huge volumes it is better you go with some standard terminals so most of the professional traders they use this nest odin xts uh, there are various other terminals but if you ask me the best terminals which i have used is odin xts and nest okay the reason is these are all developed by companies who develop web uh, this uh, trading terminals so nest is developed by a company called omnesis technologies odin is developed by a company called financial technologies so they know and they have done a lot of research on the use cases of traders so they will know how to uh, develop a good reliable software so you don't want to use a software which will uh, hang in between where you will have to restart and all those things so before we used to trade with huge volumes because we used to get leverage volumes from broker and especially when you are doing expiry trades so when you are trading with huge volumes you can't afford to restart the applications regularly first of all you will be having lot of tension on that day if things don't work in your favor and on top of this you don't want to have this headache right and not only that most of the terminals these uh, other terminals which i have used they will have the synchronization issue so for example uh, let's say i go and buy something uh, i let's say i bought one lot of bank nifty call option after that immediately it's usual that the person will go to the or uh, positions and check whether the position is there the problem with the some of the terminals is the trade would have executed but it will not show you in the positions so then obviously the next step what you will do is you will go to the order book and trade book and check whether the order is there and even there the entry won't be there so now what will you think you will think that the order has not gone for some reason you will go and place the order again and then when you come to the positions you will see that there are two lots instead of one so you actually wanted to trade one lot but you ended up trading two lots yes if it is one lot two lot it's not going to make much difference but imagine when you are doing expiry trades where you are trading huge volumes and before with leverage money i used to trade with 4000 quantity of bank nifty 3000 quantity of nifty 5000 quantity of bank nifty and imagine i place a order for 5000 and the order has not gone through now i go and place it again now i will be having 10000 which will be really difficult and you can't easily square off the position what you have taken so imagine you have taken two lots you can't go and square off one lot because you will be losing a lot of money because of slippage itself in fact i have lost a, a lot of money by using some other terminals so this is one of the reason why you should have a good terminal but yes now 
the leverage money is not there so obviously the volumes what we are trading has gone down drastically so uh, it's okay but just make sure that you have some good reliable terminal since i have been using nest i will be telling you the features of the nest and the other feature is the synchronization of the funds and let me tell you this issue i am even facing this even in zeroda fight as of today okay i have experienced this in the recent days as well so i take a trade let's say i have 5 lakhs in my account i take a trade for 1 lakh then when i go to the funds it should actually show me 4 lakh but it will not show you 4 lakh it will show you 5 lakh so i will be like okay i have 5 lakh then i will take trade for 4 lakhs thinking that i will keep 1 lakh for some emergency then when i go to the funds it will be showing zero okay in fact it has happened with me many times in zero the kite these days so this kind of synchronization issue will be there which shouldn't be there okay if you are uh, working with huge capital with uh, as a full time then these are all small things which will affect a lot in your trading career okay so that's why we use nest so if you want to use nest you just can't download it from somewhere and start using it your broker should support you and he should configure the application uh, using their uh, uh, details and after that you will be able to use it so your broker should configure that and then he should give you that nest terminal you should in install it in your soft uh, system and after that you will be able to use it so in the next part of this video i will be telling you how you should be using nest what are the features that i use in nest okay and wait and watch where i will also be disclosing how i was able to save around 75000 using some of the features of nest so i will see you guys in the next part i hope you guys like the video do like and subscribe to my channel so that you can learn more about trading and investment thank you for watching